as you guys can see by the title or maybe by the thumbnail, I am starting a brand new series called Rangers Recap, where I'm going to be recapping every Rangers game from now onwards. So the rest of the season, including the playoffs. And, you know, I thought of this idea originally, but I didn't know if it was going to come to fruition because the Rangers are pretty much playing every other night. So I don't know how I'll be able to record it, but we're going to start the series. Let's see how this goes. The Rangers, they play the Tampa Bay Lightning tonight, and it was a 2-1 to one shootout loss. Tampa would win 2-1. And we had Andre Vasilevsky versus Igor Shosturkin. And Vasilevsky made 45 out of 46 saves and had a .978 save percentage. We also had Igor Shosturkin who made 39 out of 40 saves for a .975 save percentage. So both these goalies, absolutely brilliant. It was a great, great game. And, you know, when you have two of the best goaltenders in the NHL playing against each other, two guys who have won the Vezina, two guys who faced each other in the conference finals last year, it's bound to be a good match. Not only that, it's bound to be a tight one, too, honestly. And so we have Mika Zibanejad opening the scoring, scored his 16th goal of the year off this pretty neat goal. And so, you know, the Rangers, they were leading for 7 minutes and 15 seconds remaining in the first period, the entire second period, and then approximately, let's do the math here, 14 minutes and 28 seconds left in the third period when we have Braden Point scoring this goal. And it was assisted by Nikita Kucherov and Steven Stamkos. And the game is all of a sudden tied. In overtime, the Rangers would actually get a power play, but nothing would come to fruition. And then we go to a shootout. And the shootout was also really entertaining, but not much really happened for the Rangers specifically. Trocek went first. He missed. Then Zibanejad missed. Panarin made it. Then Kako, Hedl, and Fox would all miss. And Kalorn would score the last goal. Uh, to win it but it's really just an unfortunate game and by the way these recaps are gonna be really short they're not gonna be like 10 minutes long they might be like maximum five minutes long if it's really that bad of a game or good of a game but for the rangers you know there's just a lot of questions that have to be asked first of all you know how much longer can igor shesterkin keep carrying this team i mean the rangers were pretty much leading for the entire game it's just in the third period that Braden point just scores this goal i mean it's Braden point okay he's showing us that he's a lead again I could expect that, but the defense needs to tighten up a bit. I mean, how are you going to let Igor just stand on his head every single time? And this was a main issue that happened against Tampa in the playoffs as well. There was just not enough accountability, but either way, you know, it was a good game overall. Can Igor really just pull what he did last year and just be a magician all over again? And also what's going on with Alexi Lafreniere being scratched? I mean, is Gerard Gallant planning on doing something with him? Is he going to be sent down to the minors? Is he going to be traded perhaps? You know, what could be going on with him? We obviously know that the Rangers' development has not done him or even Capo Caco any justice. They both are not even point-per-game players. We'll see what happens in the future, but otherwise, thank you guys for tuning in and have a wonderful day.